Hello, this is War Weasel again. Uh, finally, another update. I think I'm finally getting the hang of some of this locomotion stuff. And I've done a bit of work, and I thought I should actually show it off a bit so let people know that I am doing well. I am working. Here you'll see my new character. This is entirely a new skeleton, separate from the Unreal skeleton. Effectively into my into my uh, locomotion system, which I bought. And I'm finally beginning to understand. Uh, on top of that, I have lots of really cool features. One of the things I really like is this. So you can look down and actually see yourself. And which is really neat to me anyway. Of that. I do have, as you can see, IK is working properly. Yay! Which took a while. There we go. IK. And uh, all in all, it looks pretty good. On top of that, the clothing and the hair. Yeah, yeah, I know it's terrible, but. In fact, is they are separate meshes that are layered on top of the current mesh. And I think that turned out really well when we're looking at the motion. It requires a little bit of work. small bug here. Um, apparently the center of the translation changes. add some attacks shortly. Um, I have the attacks and some of the animations. I just need to move this in. Uh, I've challenged myself with getting basic melee working in a month, which is actually uh, pretty aggressive uh, for my kind of scheduling. But here looking at this, next in those swords, I have a sword idol. Here she is without her clothes on. But she looks pretty good with that sword. Beyond that, I even have some emotions. Right now I have I don't bother with the eyeballs. There's just way too much to worry about. Uh let's see. So you can see ugh, of all the ones to choose. That one's ugly. Here's smile. So, yeah, that's a smirky. Yeah, see that? And play around. Um, okay, that's not creepy at all, is it? <laughs> but it shows that the the morph targets and or shape keys are coming through from Blender, which is very, very useful. Keep popping out of that. Uh, well, I think that's about it, except for inside Blender, I'm doing some work, and here's the same character. Once I get everything, all the materials correct, and everything mapped correctly, I could put this on, and it should look fairly similar. Maybe I want to be a bit paler. Well, anyway, that's uh, a big deal for me because this is my assets working the way they should without any cheating, uh, and I'm very, very happy with it. Well, until next time, I hope to show you something soon.